Welcome back to Suvida Everything, guys. Today we are cooking a monster T-bone steak, porterhouse steak, steak Florentina, call it whatever you want, but I just know it's monster. Check it out. After speaking to a lot of my Italian friends and chefs and asking them for their opinion, they all agree in one thing, keep it simple because with such high quality steak like this, you don't need to do much, the steak will shine. So that's exactly what I'm about to do, check it out. I only seasoned it with salt and pepper, now we gotta bag it up. I'm cooking this monster steak at 135 degrees Fahrenheit for four and a half hours. We got this bohemioth ready to go and we are pumped. Let's take it out. Guys, it smells incredible. I know I say that a lot, but today is a special day. This is a bohemioth and a monster. Do you agree, Mama? Yep. All right, so like always, we're gonna pat this baby dry. Oh, look at how soft it is and jiggly. And we're gonna sear them. And I know it doesn't look that good right now, but watch this. Good friend Angel, what do you think? I love it, man. It looks like a freaking mountain or something, man. Is it, is it big enough for you? That's a lot of meat in there, man. <laughs> you gotta get the right tool for the job. Woo! I got a sword today. <laughs> yes, I am a knife collector. It's I, true. I, Are you ready to try it, Ninja? Enough talking. I let him get my ninja knives. That's right. I appreciate it. Yes. Enough talking. Are you ready to try it? Yes. Let's do it. All right. Let's it. cut this bad boy open. All right, my good friend Ninja, are you ready to try it? 
Are you ready to try it? Man, I'm ready to try it, man. <laughs> Ninja, is that big enough for you? There is no dog in this world that won't enjoy this thing, man. Look at this. And look how much filet there is left. Guys, this thing is humongous. Are you ready? Yes. All right, let's go for it. Let's take that out of your plate, my friend. Give it there. You're going to try it. from this? Let's put some candles in here. And stuff. Wow, look at that. Oh, it's... The bone is even heavy. All right, my good friend Angel, let's go for it. Let's try first the New York strip, and then we go in for the filet. Look at how tender, guys. Wow, it's like a roast is so huge. Are you ready, Ninja? Hold on, hold on. Let me, let me, let me take care of this little thing here. Oh, I can't. Oh, I can't. My mouth is salivating. Go for it. Oh! Wow. Ninja, tell us, I want to know, I'm, I'm hungry, bro. How is it? Man, I don't want to give it delicious because the filet mignon is coming. <laughs> but this is delicious. Oh my God, I have to go for it. I can't wait anymore. I can't, I can't. Oh my goodness. Is it good, Ninja? Oh my goodness. Wow, wow, wow. It's fantastic in every way. I can tell you this. If you're not using sous vide, there's no way that you can get this doneness on this type of steak. Isn't it amazing, Ninja? It's, it's delicious. <laughs> and, and besides that, guys, the flavor in this thing. It's very flavorful. I agree. It's beefy and flavorful and the salt is perfect. Everything is perfect. Here, I man. tell you this, I much rather this than a prime rib. Heck yeah. Much rather this. Heck Hold on. Are you ready no. for the filet? No, I'm not ready for that one. <laughs> Ninja, let's go! Oh, just by you touching it, it's falling apart! I'm not ready for this, man. Wow. I have no respect. Hold on a second. Look at this. This filet is going to be so flavorful, you can see the fat inside of the filet. When can you ever see fat inside of the filet? Look at the bone over there. It's all the fat in there. Look at that. That's awesome. What? Ninja, this one we have Here to we go. are, man. We have to do something we're never done. Cheers. Cheers. Let's go. Wow! <laughs> oh wow! <laughs> You're gonna enjoy it today, my mom. It has like different three tiers of flavor. It hit you first, then it hit you harder, and then it smacks you and in the face. Then and then the salt <laughs> come in and hit you in the face. And <laughs> if you are not ready for this kind of steak. If you're not drinking your vitamins and stuff, you're gonna pass out from this thing. You have to be careful. It's delicious. This one is delicious. Mama, are you ready to try it? I'm waiting. Let's go, Mama. No, no, Mama. Mama, look at me. Look at me. I'm waiting for seven minutes already. <laughs> I'm gonna try to eat fast, but I know the ninja is gonna cut me off somewhere in there and it's gonna make this thing take longer. Woo! Go for it, Mama. Ooh, the ninja is in. I don't blame you, my friend. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Oh look, he's gonna give you five. What? Wow, I'm impressed. The first steak that did my mom give a five. Congratulations, my mom. We will high five for you too. Oh, oh. my mom, the first steak the things, ever. The high five from my mom. A good steak, mate. Wow. <laughs> if we have steak like this, we have peace in, in the, the world. world. <laughs> better than picanha. What? Tell me this is not better. This one, this one specific. I'm not saying that they're gonna be able to reply that. Ninja, they can't see the sword. Turn it a little bit so they can. Ah, you it's better it. than Bikanya. Oh my God, it's better than Bikanya. <laughs> better than Bikanya. It's better than Bikanya. It's mom. better than Bikanya. Ninja, he didn't even try the filet yet. <laughs> Wait for him. Filet. Uh, no, filet. Like, okay, let's talk about the flavor. Beefy, number 10. Like. 10 out of 10. Uh, you cannot give it 10 out of 10. 100 out of 10. 200 out What's of 10. What's wrong with you? 200 out of That's 10. It. I don't care. Peace. Peace in the world. Peace in the world. That's it. Mama, I love you. I love you. Wow. I love you, Can you give a hug? Wow, look what a nice steak makes. <laughs> Woo! I never thought this day would I actually so come. I feel so humble today. I, so humble. I never thought this day would come. Woo! Anyways. <laughs> Even better than flamethrower, that's the only thing I wanted to throw. The charcoal really adds something to it. That charcoal, yeah, I agree. Go for the filet, my mom. Oh wow. my god. L look at this. It's already falling apart. Go, my mom, Zing. <laughs> my mom, quit. My mom, peace in the world, my mom. Peace in the world, my mom. Ninja, my mom, quit. Come back. Mama, Sit there. Quit. Hold on. 
How, how you can walk after this? My legs are shaking, that's why I'm coming back. This is crazy, man. Guys, for a steak to humble Ninja and give Momo a hug, I can honestly say this is a hundred times better than Picanha. <laughs> I, mean, I, I mean, man, if, if I, I don't know, you know, if, if you, I don't know. I know you are no. speechless today and we have to respect. I'm speechless. The, all right, so le let me give you some things that I think about this steak. It's very flavorful. The tenderness of the actual New York strip is just ridiculous. Now, the filet mignon, you, you don't need teeth like you said. People without teeth will have a great time chewing this one. <laughs> Perfect diet for people without teeth. I agree with you. Another thing that Momo mentioned, this one is better than a flamethrower. We have something similar here not too long ago. It was awesome. This we had the one. This is a media put... cow. This cow came from from Jupiter. She was hanging around. She was the prettiest. She was the princess. She was the queen of she the freaking place. She was treated right. <laughs> she was so beautiful. Ninja is right, the previous one that we did was with the heat gun and the charcoal flavor that in, infused into the steak is ridiculous. It's crazy. I tell you this. Charcoal, guys. Charcoal. Guys, I want to say a special thank you to Emilio from Grand Western Steaks for providing this steak to us. Emilio, you're the man, man. You are Without the... you, this would ever be possible, <laughs> man. This is awesome, Emilio. We love you, bro. Best. Dang it. Damn, you can tell that Ninja's excited. I just put the volume really down so that you won't blow up your ears. Revolt! <laughs> Take it like a man, man! I really enjoy it. I really like it. Thank you so much once again, Emilio. Guys, I hope you enjoyed awesome. this video. This was a fantastic cook. Turned out perfect in every way. Do you agree? Here we are, man. I, I want to go ahead. <laughs> I want to go ahead. I, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you're not a subscriber, be sure to subscribe for future videos. And remember, if you're interested in anything I use, everything is in the description down below. Thank you so much. And we'll see you guys on the next one. Take every, care. Everything but the flavor <laughs> and the smell. Yeah, you, because can't, it's you can't get awesome. that on the description. <laughs> ah, there is no way to describe this thing. Next time, for your holidays, do not buy prime rib. Ask for a monster T-bone porterhouse steak. It will be better. And you're going to need like three different languages to describe <laughs> this thing. <laughs> it's going to be awesome. That's marble even on the filet. This Look is the filet part, guys. Look at that. That's crazy. Hey guys, this is the aftermath of this bohemian steak. It was really an awesome cook. By the way, I want to say a special thank you once again to Emilio from Grand Western Beef, Grand Western Steaks. Grand Western Steaks, sorry. The, the link is in the description down below. But most important, just to let you guys know, if you call him, you will get a better price than if you go on the website directly. The website has a little bit higher price. And uh, just mention that Google sent you and he'll take very good care of you. He's like the largest beef provider in Florida. And he has everything. He has picanha, he has Wagyu A5, anything you can think of, He'll make it and he'll ship it out to the entire United States. By the way, I'm not being sponsored or paid to say any of this. I just really like his product, quality beef, that you can really count on. I just wanted to give him a shout out. Emilio, once again, thank you for this monster steak. Here's his phone number. Just give him a call, guys. Take care. See you on the next one. Bye-bye.